There's some special camos in Modern Warfare 3 that look better than Mastery camos, and they're super easy to get. You can get these camos in about 20 minutes. They light up, they glow in the dark, and they're super vibrant. So in this video, we're going to go over how to get these camos. We're going to unlock them for ourselves and test them out. If you want to see any more videos like this in the future, make sure to unlock that subscribe button. The first camo we're going to get is unlocked by using the Sidewinder in Zombies. All we have to do is get this to level 19, and once it's level 19, we've got to get 200 critical kills. Luckily, since we already have the Sidewinder max rank, all we have to do is head to an Xville and then just get 200 critical kills on zombies. But if we didn't have it max rank, we'd pretty much do the same thing. We'd spawn in, go to an Xville, kill zombies till we got it to level 19, and then got 200 additional crit kills. Must get headshots! Come on, come on, come on. Oh, 250 kills. That's not what we're trying to get. We're trying to get the crit kills one, but I'll take... I'll take a bonus camo. Oh, there it is. 200 kills. It's Cataphony Unlock. I don't know the name of it, but uh, we're done. No, Woo! we're done here. Xville, that was planned. Perfect timing there. Bye, zombies. We got what we're coming for. So there it is. So here's the camo we just unlocked, and it's not as good as what I thought it was going to be. It's not terrible, but the next camo we're going to unlock is probably the best base camo in the entire game, and it involves using the side widener once again. All you have to do is get it level 19, and we've got to get 10 kills while using a magnification scope in multiplayer. So when we kill 10 people, we'll get the next camo. But the really cool part about these camos is they glow in the dark. So if we take this in a darker area, you can see all of those rainbow parts get a little bit brighter here. But uh, th this example will work way better once we unlock the next camo. You'll see what I mean. One. One, two, three. And just like that, Mind Peak has now been unlocked and we can use this camo on all weapons. So to use this camo, we want to go to camos, all camos, go to wavelength, and we're going to scroll all the way over to Mind Peak and equip it. This is the Mind Peak camo in game, and this camo looks way too good for how easy it is to get. All you got to do is get the Sidewinder level 19, then get 10 kills with a sight and MP, and you got it unlocked. But it gets even better. Some weapons look amazing. Look how it looks on the cat sniper rifle. That is so clean. Every weapon you put it on, it looks a little bit different because it gets different patterns for it. This is the favorite I've seen so far. But uh, in my opinion, this camo right here looks better than a lot of the mastery camos in game. And you could probably unlock this start to finish in like 30 minutes uh, compared to, you know, the mastery camos, which takes weeks and weeks and weeks of nonstop grinding to get all of them. But real quick, I have something you have to hear. I have tried many different earbuds over the years, but they've all had one massive issue. They don't stay in my ears. And I pretty much gave up on using wireless earbuds till I started using the Raycon Everyday Buds. These are pretty much the only earbuds I can get to reliably stay in my ears, which you know are pretty important for earbuds. On top of this, they also have IPX6 water resistant and they're noise isolating. But Raycon does so much more than just delivering excellent premium audio. They just released a new line of power tech products like the faucet filter and the Magic 180 charging cable. Raycon has tons of quality tech products at an affordable price. These products have received tens of thousands five-star reviews and right now is the perfect time to check them out because raycon has an early black friday sale starting soon get 20 percent off the entire site 25 percent off fitness earbuds 30 percent off tech kits impact buds and impact speakers some of the items even being marked off up to 50 percent off get an early start on holiday sales by shopping raycon's early black friday sale today go to buyraycon.com slash lego unlock to get 20 to 50 percent off site wide huge thanks to raycon for sponsoring this video and thank you for checking them out because by doing Doing that it supports the channel for the next camo challenge we've got to get 250 kills with the plumal 762 lmg i'm gonna call it the pkm this lmg right here whatever it's called we've got to get 250 kills with it being a rare or higher tier so we brought in an aether wrench so oh nope oh yeah we put it on but on the aether wrench we'll also go ahead take some perks to make this a little bit easier now we just got to get 250 kills with this lmg and we'll unlock the next one so obviously we're going to head to an xville site once again now all we got to do is start mowing them down rinse and repeat 250 times dude getting zombie camos could not be any more easier oh there we go 100 kills in a single match that very simplistic well that's not the camo we're going for but i'll take extra camos along the way lmg go Brrrr. oh and i forgot to say this first you have to get this lmg to level 19 before you can do this camo challenge so you got to do this until you get to level 19 and then once you have it level 19 you've got to get the 250 kills with a rare tier higher version 
Oh, there we go. Oh, no, that's okay. That's just 250 kills. Not the camo we came for, but we're close. That's the camo we came for. We can't even see it. Purple ooze unlocked. Kind of got blocked there, but now we're done. But just because we got the camo we came here for doesn't mean we shouldn't continue mowing down the rest of these zombies because that would be rude. Waste not, want not. Here's the purple ooze camo in game. It looks pretty good, but once again, the next camo we're about to unlock looks even better. For this, we've got to use the PKM, the same weapon we just used. Got to get it to level 19. And once it's level 19, all we have to do is get 10 kills with all attachment slots and MP. It is uh, that simple. So uh, pretty much going to get it done this game. Oh, there it is. Sunset Retro unlocked. I really dislike how the camo pop-up gets blocked by metals. I feel like every time we unlock a camo in this game, we can't even read or see what camo we got because there's a metal blocking it on the screen. So if they could just raise the camo pop-up to be a little bit above the metal placement, that would be great. Ooh, okay. I know I said the other camo we got was my favorite that we we're gonna get in this video, but uh, I might have to change my answer. The retro sunset camo is way better than what I thought it was gonna look. And you saw how simple this was. All you have to do is get that LMG to level 19. Then you've got to get 10 kills with all attachments on it. And uh, you can then use this camo in all weapons. And it looks so, so good here in zombies. So uh, this is definitely a must get for me. Now for our next camo, we've got to use the Renetti pistol. First, we've got to get it to level 14. And then once it's 14, we've got to get 250 point blank kills in zombies. So at this point, you guys should know the drill. Step one, head to an Xville. Oh, it looks even better in darker areas. There are so many good looking base camos in this game, but this one might just take the cake for being the best. 14, now we gotta get 250 point blank kills. Easy peasy. Yeah, this pistol isn't that great in zombies. I have a feeling though, once we unlock a Kimbo and get the 50 round drum mag, this might actually be one of the better weapons, but uh, we'll have to test that out in the future. For now, we've got the small magazine and one of them. Oh, there we go. Radio waves unlock, baby. Now we can exfil. And the helicopter just left, so we gotta wait. Ah, <sighs> This is how the radio waves camo looks in game. Not bad by any means, but I think some of the other cam well, Actually, you know, the other side really does. I like the green. The green on this stands out quite a bit, but I think some of the other ones we've unlocked so far look a little bit better. Now for the next cam we have to unlock, once again being for the Renetti. Step one is to get to level 14. Now we've gotta get 10 kills while moving, nine kills while moving. Eight kills while moving. Oh, hey, bud. Hey, bud. Let me reload real quick and let me move and bye. Oh, there we go. Psychotropic unlock. Get 10 kills while moving. You know, I think it's best that I just stop telling you which one's my favorite because it keeps changing. They're all so different and just uh, they're, they're so good in their own ways. This is the Psychotropic camo in game. Another one that is a thousand percent worth getting. And since this was a pistol, you only had to get it to a pretty small level to be able to get this camo. And that took no time whatsoever. For the next camo challenge, we've got to use, what, what is this called? I think this is the WSP Stinger. Yeah, we've got to use this, get this to level 10. Then we've got to get 250 hit fire kills and zombies. And back to Xville farming to make quick work of this challenge. Oh my god, this gun is just does not have enough ammo. Even with insta-kill. There we go! Lost in transmission, 250 hit fire kills! Boom! Lost transmission camo end game, but we've still got more to grind. Now we've got to get the camo that requires getting the stinger to level 10, and we've got to get 10 kills while moving in MP. Once again, I mean it, it doesn't really get much. Oh well, if I hit my shots, it doesn't really get too much easier than this. There's one. Oh, there we go. Geofunk unlocked. Let's go. The Geofunk camo is also crazy amazing itself. Look at this. This one, dude, I, I don't I don't want to say the line again because I've already said it. This one might be my favorite out of... I, they're all good. I can't choose a favorite. I feel like just it depends on what mood you're in. Uh, this one kind of looks like another one that already exists, just way more... I don't know. I, I, here it is on the rocket launcher. Also got great coverage on this. So now let's take a look at all the different camos we've got like this because we had a few of them unlocked beforehand. Go to all camos. Uh, this category is called the wavelength. These are the ones that glow. 
we have now unlocked 11 out of 12 and the last one we don't have unlocked doesn't look that good so we're not gonna get it but now we've got this one which uh actually we haven't loaded this one in game yet. We'll, we'll 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 take a gander at this one in game uh it's not as cool this was one of the first ones i unlocked um it's i mean it gets the job done it lights up uh, i forget how we unlocked this one but we unlocked that one before we started this video so that one is by getting the reaver or the riveter which is the shotgun got to get to level 10 then you got to get 50 hip fire kills with it this is the first one we unlocked pretty cool here's the geo funk one that's the one we just showed off global panic this one is also for getting the uh riveter level 10 then you got to get 10 kills in five seconds in zombies well we'll try this one maybe it looks better in game but this one i don't know the yellow just doesn't this one's a little bit too banana like for me it, it just looks like a banana to me uh then after that one oh heat wave this one is for the mtz 762 at level 15 you've got to get 10 kills while using a scope on it in multiplayer hold on we've got to you know what? we'll put this one on the rocket launcher too uh once again we unlocked this one before we started this uh video so we weren't able to unlock it in this video Ooh, this one this one's way different in terms of the vibes that it gives compared to the other ones it's got that heat flame look to it beautiful beautiful looking also take a look at it on the rgl here very very nice we also got the lost transmission in this video we got mind peak which mind peak looks a lot like geofunk but geofunk just has a little bit more funk mind peak great as well uh i can't pronounce this one properly but that one looked good purple ooze looked great radio waves was all right sunset retro oh it's good the only one we are missing at this point is alert which is for getting uh in zombies get 50 mercenary kills so not the zombies the bots that shoot back once you get the mtz 762 level 15 you just got to get 50 kills and you unlock that one but that one and that one's kind of basic out of all of them that's the one that i'm okay missing there's a bunch of other really cool camos in here i just think the wavelength are by far the best because they glow in the dark sand's pretty interesting this is a different take on the solid camos and these are beautiful to get as well some of the skeletal ones like oh the calamity skeletal oh that's a pretty good one as well and if you want to unlock any of these camos for yourself all you have to do is go into the menu and it'll tell you the requirements you can see exactly how to go about unlocking any of these so if you see a camo you want you can uh start your grind off by doing that and i'm not saying these camos are going to replace the mastery camo but you need some camos to rock while you're grinding mastery camo so find some you like oh my these ones are good i like the darker ones like ooh, ink blot that is fire blue stain fuzzy okay those are very similar these these just this is just a little bit different that didn't change up too much but um the, the new camos they added in this game are crazy so find one you like probably one of the wavelength grind one of these get it on your weapon that way you can use this camo on all weapons while you're grinding for those sweet sweet mastery camos getting the gilded forge priceless and interstellar if you guys want to see any more videos like this in the future where we grind out everything in modern warfare 3 we're going to unlock every mp camo every zombie camo we're going to complete the ultra masteries for all the modes and see what happens with that make sure to unlock the sub button i'll see you guys in the next one have a great day peace